Now that shit's getting real, you're looking for EXCUSES! Five, four, Do it. three, two, two, Do it! Um, I'm here with the Alyssa again, and we saw KSI's video, and we thought it would be funny to react to it. Because KSI just thinks he's like the best fucking thing ever on the entire planet. And we just had to say what we had to say. You know, and I know KSI fans are gonna. Oh my gosh. Now I'm getting phone calls during videos. <laughs> I've said that to him twice. <laughs> In a row? And you never called him back? Well, I couldn't. I, I couldn't call him back because I was filming, like, or I was doing something. It was always something I was doing before I could call him back, so. <laughs> Dax! Dax! Dax. You're just a glutton for punishment, aren't you? I'm sure you're all up to date about the whole Dax situation, but if you're not, then well, just go watch my older videos because I see VA talking about it here. But alas, I got a tweet from Dax. Let's see what he said. If KSI says my name in one more video, I'm hopping on a plane to London. You know it's peak when someone replies with this. Don't get me wrong, I'm a fan of you, but what the fuck are you gonna do? <laughs> By the way, I've said your name like four or five times in this video already, so I guess you're coming to London, right? Anyway, I saw this and I had to reply. Want me to pay for your flight accommodation? <laughs> and yeah, he came back with first class, five star, and I want to be picked up from the airport in a luxury vehicle that says, it's Dax on the license plate. Book that shit right now if you really got a sack. Why do millions of us claim the world of tanks? Well, I like to add in front of the middle of the video. Fam, do you, do you know who you're talking to? Did you not see what I did to Net Nobody? I flew his baby mama from America to England to be in my music video on a diss track against him. You think I'm playing? You think this is a joke? <laughs> I don't play, motherfucker. <laughs> Trust me, fam. I've got your first class he flight ready that's to be booked. And he's like, I feel like KSI, like, even though he's talking all this shit, he can actually back it up when it comes to fighting because he is a trained fighter. He's not just, like, talking shit online. Like, he's an actual trained fighter, so. But I don't even know why. Why <laughs> Dax even. <laughs> why Dax even. <went. laughs> oh, man. Why isn't it kind of stupid for Dax to call him out and know? Yeah. That's kind of stupid. I look him on the And this is coming from someone who doesn't really like KSI. Like, I got to have KSI's back when it comes to this. But, you know, like, man. LA to London, direct flight. I've got the hotel ready, but for your sake, I'm not going to let the people know where you're going to be staying. And best believe I've got Addison Lee, exec. With your name on it, waiting for your sideshow bob looking ass. We're at different levels, Dax. The sooner you realize oh. that, the better. Anyway, I came back with only if we're sparring for six rounds, three minutes when you're here. Need to, Need to make minutes. you say sorry again, innit? I mean, if you're saying sorry to talk. It's loaded. Oh, what? <laughs> Lanes. You look at it, it's <laughs> like gonna it's be buffering and it's like it's not. Oh, that's why it's on HD. Don't ever run YouTube in HD. <laughs> it makes you buffer longer. <laughs> when you meet me. I do honest, at this point, I was sure he was going to just back down. But nope, he came back with this. Deal. Got a shows this week back home in Canada and dates lined up. Week before tour. It's clear! We'll start boxing classes next week. Give me a few weeks to train and in six rounds, three minutes before I leave for tour with Tech 9 on April 11. Now obviously he thinks he's sick. You know, letting everyone know that he's doing shows and <laughs> going on tour. And he even added Tech 9 to, you know, let everyone know that he's really doing big things right now. Ultimately, I don't give a fuck about your shows. I just want to beat the shit out of you. Anyway, he said deal. So I replied with this. <laughs> DM me your passport details and I'll sort you out a nice three day trip. Good luck fam. Like I said, I'm serious about this shit. But then, <sighs> then he replied with this. Good luck to you as well. Details coming. This will go down in history. This 
but will, will go down in history. I mean, maybe for you, but for me, this this ain't shit. I, mean, I don't think you realize what you just signed up for. You think you can just put on some gloves and beat the YouTube boxing champion of the world? Actually, you know what? Scrap all of that. I'm not even gonna make this corny. You think you can beat someone that has been training for almost two years? Just because you're shredded doesn't mean you. That's true though. Yeah. They say you've been and training he, for two years. And Dex is talking about a couple of weeks, but what about the fuck is a couple of weeks of training gonna do you compared to two years of training? Like he'll knock <laughs> him out. Like, like his yeah. face is gonna get punched in. <laughs> <laughs> you don't have to knock someone out. But I mean, you know what? Actually, you'll see. So I followed him on Twitter <laughs> and I instantly DM'd him. And I realized he'd already uh, <laughs> messaged me before. My G, what's good? You think you can talk all that tough talk publicly and then try to nice me in private? <laughs> Get the fuck out of here with that <laughs> bullshit! Where's the photo of your passport? Dude, in so the bad. studio right now making hits. Passport oh is at the crib. Breath, nigga. This guy doesn't even know how to spell breathe. <laughs> Fuck my life, man. Once I get back, I'll see what day I'm supposed to report to Kansas City. <laughs> it's oh, B-C-K. Just, just send me B. a passport. And then, yeah, he finally showed me his passport details. And I realized he's, he's actually younger than me. And he's also Nigerian. Ah, oh, what a shame. <laughs> You're gonna have to teach one of my fellow brothers <laughs> goddamn lessons. What airport are you flying from? LAX. Also, hit me up with how sparring works. Hit me up with how sparring works. Hit me up with how sparring works. Why would you ask that? This guy literally has no clue. He doesn't even understand what he signed up for. How can he be so stupid? I mean, I get that he's doing this for clout. He even said this. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. In goddamn 2019, we're turning the word clout chaser to a positive term. So this guy is literally the worst type of person. Substituting. <laughs> what? He said, we're going to turn clout chasing into a positive thing. Clout chasing, I think, is like when you go try to get somebody else's fame by like stirring up like attention man like it's like if um that's all like people him, like to do to be honest they all like to stir up attention so you trying to fight ksi so you can get that those numbers but it's kind of like what what how's that gonna do you any good when you get knocked out like, you're going to get all those people, but it's going to be in a negative way. Mm -hmm. Like, they're just going to... Yeah, and his face might just get deranged, too. <laughs> like... It's really not worth it, Dax. I mean... He I, just asked him! Like, hit me up with how sparring works. What? Like, why would you ask somebody that you talent to fight with? Oh, how, like, can yeah. you teach me how to spar? No, he's not going to teach you how to spar! <laughs> Like, he, he's trying to fight you because you called him out and challenged him. Now you're trying to get lessons? It's kind of weird, right? It's kind of... Okay. It's kind of... Integrity yeah. for clout. So foolish, but... I mean, I digress. Gotta take an explanation and all that to tour management on Monday for approval. So I just sent him this. Mate. Yeah. Yeah. If anything, I could see them wanting number of rounds, maybe change, that's about it. Shut the fuck up! Don't give me that management bullshit! You want to change the number of rounds because you've realized you've publicly fucked up! Fucking pussy. You train every day, huh? So six rounds, three minutes should be nothing for you. So I came back with, how many rounds you want, nigga? Don't start making excuses now. <laughs> Shit's going down, lol, 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 lol. Just gotta consult the people who are paying me thousands of dollars to perform. That has nothing to do with the fight. It doesn't matter. Media, I say that, that doesn't matter. That doesn't matter. Hotel to our flight. That's, so we I feel like you. that's completely Nah, irrelevant. he's just, man. Oh, if you gotta, all if you gotta ask to fight somebody, you a pussy. <laughs> you, know, you gotta ask to fight somebody. You a pussy. What? Just... 
Man, there's something wrong with him. I, I just like he's asking. Like okay, so process. so this thing in process is, I called somebody out to fight, and when <laughs> they respond, <laughs> when they respond, when he I knows. I bring up all this management stuff and how I'm working, and it, like that's irrelevant. Like it doesn't matter. I mean, if he's worried about his face getting messed up, his face is already messed up. Oh. Um, <laughs> Now I will say I I've liked Dax's music in the past, but recently in these past couple of like weeks, they've really been exposing how much he acts hard, and then when backs someone out. like he will back out when someone calls him out or like people jumped him at one of his shows after one of his shows because he distracted another rapper called Tory Lanez, and when they caught up to him, they made him apologize. And then his uh, his argument was, oh, well, uh, I got a kid or whatever. It doesn't matter. You know, that's, yeah, that, that sucks. If you, you got a kid, then don't. Don't do that stuff. Don't even put yourself in a position if you have a kid. So it sounds like you're just out here starting trouble. That I signed a contract for. I don't give a fuck, nigga. You've probably said that you want to fight me countless times. You even said you'd beat me. Now that shit's getting real, you're looking for EXCUSES! I'm booking you a 10k first class flight! 5th of April to 8th of April! 5th, you arrive! 6th, I come over, we do this spa, and I make you apologize again like the pussy you are! 7th, you can go see Buckingham Palace or some shit! Ha 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 I'm fighting you my G. I'ma hit you Monday. I'll know then if they allow me to fight before tour, we will. If they tell me to wait till after tour, when I'm not contractually bind, then we will fight a couple weeks after I'm off the tour. Wait till Monday and I'll have word. And watch your mouth before you speak on stories you know nothing about. Your ass would have cried that night. <laughs> He's talking about the whole Tory Lane situation, so check my video if you don't understand that. I'll talk on anything I want, and you ain't gonna do a fucking thing about it. You demanded for all these terms, and I have delivered on every single one. And yet you are still <laughs> looking for excuses if you wanted to fight. You a fucking comedian. <laughs> Fight's going down. We'll have details tomorrow on exams. You get knocked out. You get knocked out. My shit's locked in. La 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 are you fucking dumb? No, you're, you're actually ah. stupid. Saying you would publicly beat me in a boxing match is you moving precise. You literally said this. Do you box, bro? Because I don't think. I, I don't. I don't. I've never boxed before, but I know that anything I set my mind to, it's game over. And you think you're moving Wait. precise? Wait, Zero he said, training. He said, "Okay, that's true. I guess if you set your mind to something, you can do it." But. Let's not be delusional here. You have to put in work on top of yeah. having your mind believe in it for it to happen. So you would have needed to train for months and months, maybe 12 months. Because he trained for two years, trained for 12 <laughs> months. And then put your mind to it. And then maybe you have a chance. But you're saying, oh, I can just put my mind to something. No, that's, that's not how it works. you got to put in work too. You can't just... Say, oh, I'm gonna win, and you're gonna win. That's that's just delusion. That's that's like saying I'm gonna go to college, and I'm gonna get a degree in a week when you gotta go for four years. Yeah. Come on now, it's like, bruh, <laughs> this dude. And you think you could beat me in a boxing match? How are you so stupid? Holy fuck! This nigga even put hashtag chess! God fucking damn it, man. This guy is a joke. Hands off. He's the biggest joke on YouTube right now. He's and to make be. matters worse, yeah. to top it all off, he has delusional fans. My G Dax. Knock him out, bro. Why are you training for a spa with KSI? A couple weeks training isn't going to do much. Have you even seen how Dax is built? Comparing Dax to KSI is like 
they're comparing a Ferrari to a 1978 AMC Concorde. One punch and KSI is out. KSI is getting slapped up. That's you guys are whoever said this, y'all are idiots because you know that KSI is a trained fighter. When it comes to that, it doesn't matter who has more muscle or not. At the yeah. end of the day, KSI is trained. Dax can be big and buff and all he wants, but if he can't knock somebody out, he's in trouble. I That's mean, to be honest, like, there's this dude that was, like, bigger than me and taller than me, yeah. and he was talking shit, and, like, like, my side didn't matter. Like, I punched him dead in the mouth. Yeah, and sometimes so it's, it's just like, like, size don't matter. When it comes to skill, it's, yes. it's, it's not like, you used to wrestle, right? Yeah, I, I used to wrestle in high school. Come yeah. on now. And I used to do kickboxing, like. like come on. <laughs> straight fighting ain't shit. Let yeah. me just tell you that. That yeah, ain't straight shit. Fighting. That's just pussy fight. <laughs> like. <laughs> Will knock KSI out. JJ finna get his shit clapped. <laughs> That's I don't know how you have fans, but this shit ain't making it easier for them to ride with you, bro. By the way, I can't wait for you to hit me up. Like, sorry, man, my management won't let me fight you. Guess I'll just have to fight you after my tour. <laughs> By the way, did I mention it's with Tech Nine? My management Hashtags. won't let me fight. If you are being controlled to that point, to where you can't just do stuff. You, it's like he's asking his mom. You have to, you have to, you pay your managers, right? So why do you have to go to these? You're their boss. This makes no sense. Hmm. Mm -mm. That's interesting, you know. Dex, who are you? Bro? It's like he's asking his mom. Yeah, it's come on, Dex. Yeah, looks like <laughs> looks like I'm fighting Dex. Unreal. Anyway. uh... <laughs> This man got the Thanos glove. Oh my god. That's kind of horrible. Bro, the most evil YouTuber. You, Dax, you're stupid. You fuck with the most evil YouTuber on YouTube. You were retarded, bro. Like, man. <laughs> like, literally. All of us just. Man. Literally, he is the most. I don't think evil. he was expecting KSI to, like, come back with all of that. Probably didn't. Probably was like, no. KSI ain't gonna do nothing. And then, with, with, I don't know why. Oh, like, but, obviously, he was gonna do something. Like, it's like, look at his track record. Record. Yeah, like, you know how KSI is. Like he what? had another dude, baby mama, in the same bed with him in that video. <laughs> like, <laughs> this, like this dude will. Oh my God! Like he'll do anything to take you down. <laughs> <laughs> like he's good at destroy decks, and I'm gonna watch that video with popcorn. Like, <laughs> like it's gonna be crazy. It's gonna be funny. Hey, it's gonna be funny. <laughs> hey, Boomer. This is Boomer. <laughs> you haven't met him yet. Yeah. Anyways, guys, I hope you subscribe to this video. Thank you so much for <laughs> watching. Should I do it? The old Arlenator saying, and peace. <laughs>